Hello, welcome to Arvind Singh Academy and we are discussing linear equations and this is the lecture number 7. I hope you have already watched part 1 to part 6 before watching this part 7. Uh, we have almost completed but uh, miscellaneous questions uh, uh, from miscellaneous exercise that we have to discuss. So today we are going to discuss them that miscellaneous exercise. We are going to discuss miscellaneous miscellaneous exercise right exercise size right so this is what uh, the first question from this topic is miscellaneous exercise because many students are facing difficulties in miscellaneous exercise and some important questions are also given in miscellaneous exercise so that is why i am going to discuss this in miscellaneous exercise <clears throat> the first question which is given from 1 to 6 that is a similar pattern solve the inequalities the inequalities uh, let me solve this quickly um, you will be definitely able to understand it first question is given that 3x minus 4 is greater than 2 and less than 5 so for solution we can write here that uh, 4 can be added both the sides so 2 plus 4 is greater than 3x is less than 5 plus 4 if 4 will added all of them then a sign of inequality will not change and if 4 is added then minus 4 plus 4 will be 0 so in that case this will be 3x is less than 9 and greater than 6 and if you divide by 3 again then it will be 2 is greater than x and less than 3 so this is the solution and therefore solution can be written as solution can be written as x belong to close interval 2 to 3 right i hope you got this now second question is there and the second question is given like minus 3 into 2x minus 4 is less than less than 12 and greater than equal to 6 here less than 12 only given not equal to so less than 12 only so what to do first you have to for solution you need to do it like uh, this is minus 3 into 2 minus 6x six plus 12 is less than 12 is greater than 6 so 12 can be subtracted both the sides so that will be minus 6 and this is minus 6 and that will be 0 isn't it 12 can be subtracted from both the sides then what will happen in that case it will come like x is if you divide by 6 sign of inequality will change so if x will be this will come this side 0 and that will be this side that is minus 6 divided by minus 6 is 1 so this is the solution and therefore solution can be written as solution is lies between x is equal to open interval 0 and 1 is closed interval so this is the second one now the third question is given here and the third question is written like 4 minus 7x by 2 is greater than equal to minus 3 and less than equal to 18 less than equal to 18 to solve them first we need to subtract 4 from both the sides so minus 3 minus 4 is less than minus 7x by 2 is less than 18 minus 4 so we can do it again that uh, minus 7x by 2 is greater than minus 7 and less than 14. So we can divide it by 2, multiply by 2. So it will be minus 14, minus 7x and 28. Now if you divide by 7, then sign of inequality will change. 7, 4 here, 28 and that will be minus 4. So it will be minus 4 x is there sign of inequality will change so greater than will be less than and less than will be greater than so 7 divided by 2 that is less than 2 because minus minus cancel so here the solution will be solution is x belong to where this is minus 4 to 2 both of them are included now i hope you got it and next question there is question number 4 and question number 4 is similar like that is 3 times of x minus 2 upon 5 is less than equal to 0 and greater than minus 15 
So I can multiply by 5. So this will be 3x minus 6 is less than 0 and greater than 75, isn't it? Minus 75 because I have multiplied by both the sides. So 3x is less than 6. 6 can be added. And here if you will add 6 then this will be minus 69. Now accordingly x can be there for x can be written as x is lies between where x is we can write here now let me write this this employee x can be lies between where a minus 23 because divide by 3 and 3 is positive number so sign of inequality will not change and therefore solution is minus 23 to 2 x belong to minus 23 to 2 and this will be the solution so this is just solution of question number 4 now question number 5 let us uh, solve some questions more questions and the fifth question is given like 4 minus 3x upon minus 5 is greater than what minus 12 and less than equal to 2 so to solve them First, you have to subtract 4 from both the sides. So, it will be minus 12 minus 4 is less than minus 3x upon minus 5. That is plus 5, isn't it? Minus minus plus. And uh, <coughs> that is less than 2 minus 4. So, this employee, it will come like minus 16 is less than 3x by 5 is less than equal to minus 2. So, multiply by 5 what will happen this will be minus 80 and less than minus 10 isn't it so minus 80 and less than minus 10 so x is less than minus 10 by 3 and greater than minus 80 by 3 3 is positive number so there will be no change and therefore solution is equal to solution is given by x belong to minus 80 by 3 and minus 10 by 3 so that will be the answer right i hope you got it now question number 6 let us solve question number 6 is there and 6 is that is 3x 6 i can write here only uh, 6 is there let me write here this is the space left so we can write here this is 3x plus 11 upon 2 is less than equal to 11 and greater than equal to 7 so i can write here 3x plus 11 is less than 22 and greater than 14 isn't it because 2 can be multiplied both the sides now 11 has to remove so 11 can be subtracted both the sides 11 and this is 14 minus 11 so 3x is greater than 3 and less than 11 right and therefore x can be written as less than 11 by 3 and greater than 1 and therefore solution set will be solution is, is what x belong to this is 1 and 11 by 3 that will be the answer so hopefully you got it right now from 7th to 7th 8 9 10 these are the questions which uh, is language problem so you have to solve the equation it is given solve the equations from 7 to 10 from 7 to 10 and represent in equations solve the inequations inequalities from 7 to 10 solve the inequalities from 7 to 10 7 to 10 question and represent on number line 7 to 10 and represent on represent on number line represent on number line okay so number line that you have to do so question number 7 to 10 now question number 7 is given so let us write here question number 7 and question number 7 is given that 5x plus 1 right is greater than 24 minus 24 and 5x minus 1 is less than 5x minus 1 is less than 24 so these are the two equations 
to any questions in fact and we have to solve them so we can write here this implies 5x is greater than minus 1 come this side it will be minus 25 and x is greater than minus 5 this is the first one second one is 5x is less than 25 and x is less than 5 so this is second one if we represent them on number line system then what will happen let me draw a number line and then we will uh, find the solutions if this is a number line say this one is a number line then uh, there is a marking marking is like 0 this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, is it it? This is minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5, minus 6, isn't it? Here also it will be 6 like that. x is less than 5. From first equation it is said that x is greater than minus 5 and x is less than 5. So both the conditions are satisfied from first x should be greater than minus 5 so greater than minus 5 can be like this right now x is greater than minus 5 first according to first one they say like this right now x is greater than minus 5 i hope you got it and the second one is says that x is less than 5 less than 5 anything can be possible right now so less than 5 so we can write here x is greater than 5 less than 5 that is this one in excluding 5 and x is greater than minus 5 that is excluding minus 5 so the common solutions where both of them lies is between what minus 5 to 5 and therefore this is a number solution here from first and second first and second here from first and second we can write from first and second we can write x is greater than minus 5 and less than 5 this is the solution answer right but here we have to solve a number line system that we have written. So the common solution which lies between with minus 5 to 5. This is the common solution. So it is given the boundary here. Right now, this is a boundary. So it lies between minus 5 to 5. Question number 7 is there. Now we have question number 8. And question number 8 is there. That 2 times of x minus 1 is less than x plus 5 and the second inequality is given that 3 times of x plus 2 is greater than 2 minus x. These are the two inequalities we can solve them independently that is 2x minus 2 is less than x plus 5. x will come this side 2x minus x will be here and 2 will come this side so 5 plus 2 x is less than 7 this is the first. Now second one is uh, we can do it like uh, 3x plus 6 is greater than 2 minus x so x will come this side this will be 3x plus x and greater than 2 minus 6 4x is greater than minus 4 and therefore x is greater than minus 1 this is second so x is greater than minus 1 and x is less than 7 so from first and second solution will be from first and second the solution will be solution is x is greater than minus 1 and less than 7 that is the solution but as far as we have to represent on number line system we can make it like this solution is like here so we can do this and on number line system there is two lines say this is say here we have represented this is the common area common region and common solution so we can uh, make it like this is a uh, one is common 
right now let's go next comment so in between them there is a solutions right now so this is the solution i hope you got it okay so on number line system this will be the solutions and it can be represented like here this is the solutions right got it i hope you got it okay so question number nine nine is there and question number nine is nothing else but uh, let me it is given that 3x minus 7 is greater than 2 times of x minus 6. This is the first inequality and second inequality is given. This is the first one and second one is given like uh, 6 minus x is greater than 11 minus 2x. This is the second one. So from first this can be written as 3x minus 7 is greater than 2x minus 12 and 2x will come this side so it will be x age greater than minus 5 right now this is the first one the second one from second it is given that 6 minus x so 2x will come this side it will be positive isn't it so in this case 2x will be positive and x is negative is greater than 11 minus 6 so this employee x age greater than 5 this is the second one so here a number line system uh, if i am saying that x is greater than 5 and x is greater than minus 5 therefore from first and second first and second the cost solution will be the common solution will be common solution is x is greater than 5 x is greater than 5 or x belong to 5 to infinity 5 to infinity 5 to infinity you can write like this okay now on number line if i would like to represent on number line then what will happen say this is the number line okay and on this line there is x is greater than minus 5 so we can draw another line which is greater than minus 5 right that is greater than minus 5 okay and uh, y is greater than 5 so there will be another line that is greater than 5 okay so we can have the common solution like x is greater than 5 so common solutions will be there this is x is greater than 5, 5 is here and uh, this is uh, say 0 is there and minus 5 is here, right. So x is greater than minus 5, so minus 5 is not included, x is greater than 5, so this 5 is also not included. So common solutions here lies in both where both of the lines exist, right now. So we can write here the common solution lies at between these two right now so common solutions lies between here these two from here to forward so here the solution is 5 to infinity that is from this side to from this place to this is a common solution so you can write here so this area represents the common solutions. I hope you got it. Now question number 10. And the question number 10 is there. Question number 10. 5 times of 2x minus 7 minus 3 times of 2x plus 3 is less than 0. And the second one is 2x plus 19 is less than 6x plus 47. So you can do that. For this employee, this is 10x minus 14 minus 3 to the 6x minus 9 is less than 0. 10x minus 6x is 4x and 14 minus 9 is 23 and will come this side and it will be 23. So x is nothing else but less than this employee, x is less than 23 by 4, right? And this one we can write 2x is minus 6x is less than 47 minus 19 so minus 4x is less than this employee minus 4x is less than 
and 17 minus 8 and 3 minus 1 is 2, 28. So, x is less than minus x is less than 7, divide by 4 and again divide by minus, so it will be minus 7, inequality of sign will change. So, this employee like this, we can write, even from this, we can write it directly this. So, x is greater than minus 7 and x is less than, so from first and second, again this is first, this is second, from first and second, we can say that x is greater than, x belong to minus 7 and 23 by 4, this is the common solution, that is, we can write x is greater than minus 7 and less than equal to 23 by 4. This is the solution. On number line, if you want to represent it, again you can do the same item, same thing. Let me represent on number line system. This is a number line, you know, and here is a value which is like a, a 23 by 4 somewhere. And uh, this one is the value which is like greater than minus 7. So answer is like between these two. You can represent long number lines and there will be area which will represent this. This is the solution, excluding, including both of them. So this is a number line. You can draw many lines as you require because one is greater than 7, that is like this. Another is less than, so that will be like this. Here is a number line. So we can draw this greater than 7 right and someone is less than less than so 23 so that will be like this also right so common solution will be in between i hope you got it okay now we can write it like this And uh, what about this one is? This one is like between minus 7 to so the common solution is like between here this one and this one. I hope you got it. So this is the common solution where both the lines just I hope you did it and you got it. Okay. So these are something and uh, hopefully you will be able to understand this. And uh, now uh, some questions are there uh, related to word problem. So let us solve them. Word problem. Question number 11 and onward from question number 11. 11 is there and this is a question which is given that a solution is to be kept a solution is to be kept kept between 68 between 68 degree Fahrenheit and 77 degree Fahrenheit right what is the range of temperature in degree Celsius? What is the range of temperature? What is the range of temperature in degree Celsius? In degree Celsius? In degree Celsius? In degree Celsius? Celsius C. If the Celsius and Fahrenheit, if the Celsius, Celsius and Fahrenheit, Celsius and Fahrenheit and Fahrenheit, Fahrenheit F. 
कन्वर्जन फॉर्मूला इज कन्वर्जन फॉर्मूला इज फॉर्मूला इज गिवेन हियर दैट इज एफ अपॉन एफ इज इक्वल टू नाइन बाई फाइव सी प्लस थर्टी टू नाउ वी हैव टू सॉल्व सोल्यूशन इज देयर वॉट इज द सोल्यूशन सो सिंस एफ इज लाइज बिटवीन एफ इज फॉरनाइट दिस इज गिवेन फॉरनाइट So lies between between means not equal to 68 degree Fahrenheit and that is 77 degree Fahrenheit. Now in place of F we can write here. This is 9 by 5 C. We can write here 9 by 5 C plus 32 is less than 77 and greater than 68. Okay. So this 32 will be subtracted from this side. This will be What of uh, seven minus two is five, and this is seven minus three is four forty-five. Nine by five C is greater than, and this employee further can be written as C lies between. If you multiply by C, nine by five will be five by nine, so five by nine into forty-five, and this will be thirty-six into five by nine. Multiply by five by nine both the sides so that will be nine four zero thirty six. Get it nine five zero forty five. Five four zero twenty. So this is twenty and less than twenty five. So in degree Celsius, the range of temperature is between twenty to twenty five. So therefore, the range of temperature. This is the range of temperature between twenty degree Celsius to twenty five degree Celsius and twenty five degree Celsius. Right, this is what. Now there is a question, and that is question number twelve. This is very important one. You should write it, and you should understand it. A boric so a solution of eight percent boric acid. Solution of eight percent boric acid. Boric acid is to be diluted. Is to be diluted. Is to be diluted by adding by adding two percent boric acid solution. Boric acid solution. Right, two percent boric acid solution to it. To it. The resulting mixture is the resulting mixture. The resulting mixture, for instance, there. The resulting mixture is to be more than four percent. Is to be more than four percent, right? More than four percent, but less than eight percent. Less than six percent, but less than six percent, right? Boric acid. Boric acid, right? Now, if we have, if we have six hundred and forty liters of eight percent solution, liters of eight percent solution, how many liters of, how many liters of, how many Liters of of two percent boric acid, two percent solution, two percent solution will have to be added. Will have to be added. To be added. Now, for solving this question, we can write here. Let x liter of Two percent boric acid, acid added to six hundred and forty liter of liter of eight percent boric acid. Boric acid, isn't it? So the output should be greater than four percent, but less than more than four percent, but less than six percent boric acid, isn't it? So we have to, and already this is eight percent and two percent. These are the two types. 
so more than four percent and less than six percent so as per the question you can write here in 640 liter there is eight percent boric acid plus x liter if i have added then in this x liter there is how many percent of boric acid two percent boric acid and the whole output will be less than 6% of, of 640 liter was earlier and x liter was mixed. So less than 6% of 640 plus x and that must be greater than 4% of 640 plus x. Not equal to more than and less than. So equal to sign is not suitable here. Yeah. Now we can do it x liter there are three inequalities we can make it separate you know so there are one two and three three inequalities we can do it together as well but maybe uh, it will be lengthy for you so let me uh, write here four percent percent can be cancelled from everywhere because percentage is there so we can cancel 640 plus x is less than 2x plus 640 into 8 right now is less than 6 into 640 plus x okay now from first and second we can go ahead from first and second first and second we have 4 4 ja, 16 so this will be 6 0 and this will be 4 6 ja, 24 plus 125 plus 4x is less than 2x plus multiply by 4 this will be 5120 5120 isn't it 2x plus 5120 so if 2x will come this side this employee 2x 4x minus 2x is less than 2560 because 5120 minus 2560 that is 52560 so here 2x is this employee 2x is less than 1 2 8 0 right now and this employee x must be less than 640 because divide by 2 so this is first now again moving with the second and third from second and third second and third we have lessons like 2x plus 5 1 this is 2x plus 5 1 2 0 is less than 6 4 is 24 and 6 is 36 and 2 38 right plus 6 6 so here we can write um, this 2x will come this side and this will come this side so this will be 1 2 8 0 right now is greater than 6 6 minus 2x 6 6 minus 2x that is 1 2 8 0 is greater than 4x and x must be greater than 320 so this is equation second and therefore from first and second it is said that x must be greater than 320 and less than 640 so from first and second we conclude that we have x is greater than 320 right and less than 640 this will be the answer i hope you got it right okay now the next question is there question number 13 and 13 question says how many liters of water how many liters of water water will have to be added will have to be added added to 1125 liters of 45 percent solutions liters of 40 of the 45 percent solution 45 percent solution right 45 percent solution of ac of ac so that the resulting mixture so that the resulting mixture
will contain more than 25% but less than less than 30% acid content right acid content so this is the question how many liters of water water has no acid clear now and 1125 so let x liter water is being added we can write in solution in the similar way solution is let x liter water water is being added being added to 1125 liter of 45% acid solution acid solution right so according to question what will happen now if i will write here then this will be 1125 and 45% in that is acid content right plus 0% in x liter and that is less than it is more than 25 but less than 30 so this is less than 30 percent of 1125 plus x in the similar way what we did earlier and that will be also more than 25 percent of 1125 plus x isn't it so we can write it further that percentage can be cancelled because there is a percent everywhere so we can cancel them 25 into 1125 plus x is less than 45 1125 into 45 isn't it 1125 into 45 0 multiply by everything is 0 and here 30 multiply by 1125 plus x we can cancel by 5 to make it easier now so that can be a 5 right here 5 9 is 45 5 6 is 30 so we can cancel like this now it will be more simpler form and we can do this therefore this employee this will be 5 multiply this 125 so 5 11 5 is 55 plus 156 plus 5x is less than 9 5 to 45 and 9 2 to 18 and 4 22 carry 2 11 9 the 99 and 2 99 and 2 is 101 is less than 6 multiplied by the 6 5 to 30 you know and 6 to 12 plus 15 carry 1 and 11 to 66 plus 67 plus 6 6 okay now there are three inequalities which uh, you have so one this is two and this is three so from first and second again we can proceed in the same way from first and second from first and second we have five six two five plus five x is less than one zero one two five and therefore five x this employee five x is less than 25 25 is 0 0 and uh, 11 minus 6 is 5 and this is 9 9 minus 5 is 4 so x is less than 900 this is first one now from second and third from second and third we have 10125 is greater than 16750 plus 6x so that will be 10125 minus 6750 is less than 6x isn't it and further it can be written as 5 and 12 minus 5 is 7 and 10 minus 7 is 3 and 9 minus 6 is 3 is greater than 6x i hope you got it and therefore this employee x is greater than if you divide by 6, 6, 5, 30 and carry 3, 3 is 37, so 6, 6, 36, 1 and 6, 2, 12 and 3, so this is 5. So this is second part and therefore the range of from first and second, 
first and second x lies between 562.5 liter and less than 900 liter that would be answer so range of water which is to be uh, put into that that will be more than this and less than this now one more question is there and let us see this question question number 14 and this question is given like iq of a person IQ of the person person is given by the formula is given by the formula formula that IQ is equal to mental MA upon CA multiply by 100 right where MA is where MA is mental age mental age right and c a is and c a is chronological age chronological age age right if i q is i q is greater than 80 and less than 140 for a group of 12 year old for a group of 12 year old old children children find the range of their mental age find the range of their mental age of their mental age right now so this is what if iq is like this so what to do mental age iq is lies between uh, chronological age is given and mental age is also even chronological age same for everyone na? so mental age to be calculated now solution age since iq is lies between solution since iq is lies between is greater than 80 and less than 140 right now iq is greater than 80 and less than 140 this is what given here greater than 80 and less than 140 this is given here right less than equal to 140 so i can use the formula mental age upon chronological age multiply by 100 so this is mental age upon ca in 200 is less than 140 and is greater than 80 right we can do that now children age of 12 year so chronological age is 12 it is given there so here mental age to be calculated if this is 12 and this is 100 can be divided both the sides so this is 140 by 100 and that will be 80 by 100 100 can be divided now mental age you have to calculate 0 0 cancel and this 0 0 cancel so mental age can be multiply by 14 by 10 multiply by 12 and here 8 by 10 multiply by 12 so in that way it will come like mental age it will come like this is 5 or even you can multiply without cancelling them 4 is 48 4 and 12 plus 4 16 divided by 10 that is 16.8 and here 12 is 96 divided by this so 9.6 so that will be the answer of this question mental age must be lies between 9.6 to 16.8 for children right i hope you got it so that will be answer i hope you got it so that's all in this chapter and this has been completed nicely and each and every question has been solved so uh, there is uh, no problem i think so but i requested you uh, already that you must try to solve questions which is given in booklet and study material and also i hope that you will uh, try to solve questions given in exercise as well so thank you very much for watching this and don't sub 
uh, forget to subscribe this channel please subscribe it and share to your friends as well thank you thank you very much god bless